Teams keep coming to Trey Young, and Trey Young keeps finding a way to torch every single one of them. Take Wednesday night in Bedlam. OSU held Young to just one of six shooting from three. He still scored 27 points and almost had a triple-double. Part of what's made him such must-watch TV is we keep on waiting to see if somebody can finally somehow make Trey look a little human. How about number six, West Virginia? Sooners at the Mountaineers tonight. Would be Oklahoma's third road win over a top 10 team on the year. First half, Trey doing what he does. Banks in the deep tray. But the Mountaineers were out to protect their home court in this one from the jump. Teddy Allen scores and West Virginia goes up by a pair. Jamani McNeese flying high. Throws down that dish from Young. Then slams this dime from Cameron McGusty. Game knotted up at 29. But Javon Carter scores 12 of West Virginia's next 14. That puts the Mountaineers up by 10. And on defense, pretty rough and tough with Trey Young. Trey, just 3 of 11 from the field. 1 of 6 from 3 in the first half of this one. And some really pretty ugly looking shots mixed in there. Sooners down 8 at the break. Trey finds it after the break. See, this is the silly deep range we're used to seeing from him. OU goes up 51 to 49, but like kids passing around a cheat sheet, West Virginia had all the answers. Teddy Allen puts the Sooners down by 10. Young, give him credit, kept fighting to the end. The turnover feeds Richard Odoms for two. It's a six point game, but there would be no miracles for Oklahoma down the stretch as the Mountaineers bring that 10 game Sooner win streak to a close tonight. 89 to 76, the final score in this one. Mountaineers holding OU almost 20 points below their scoring average for the year. Young does get his 29 points, but shoots just three of 12 from three, only five assists. One Sooner you didn't hear at all about in that highlight, Oklahoma's other stud freshman, Brady Manick. He did not score a single point in 23 minutes of play. And hey, it's not going to get much easier for OU. Next week's schedule includes number 18, Texas Tech, and then number 16, TCU. Both teams heading to Norman.